Hi, I'm Pat Yingling. I was a pregnancy abortion counselor right here up on Joy Street, 3 Joy Street from 1970 and 1971. We were able to help a lot of women get to England, to get to New York, to get an abortion that they needed. But some people didn't have this. So this is a tribute to someone who's been um, behind my work. Uh, closer? Okay. Bruce, it's a tribute to someone who's been behind my work uh, working on a, board, a book about abortion then and now. On October 3rd, 1977, Rosie Jimenez died from the effects of an illegal, unsafe abortion. When she died, she had her Medicaid card and an uncashed scholarship check in her purse. Neither of them was of any use to her. Congress, in an act, an exceptional act of cruelty and cowardice, had passed the Hyde Amendment, making it illegal to use Medicaid funds to pay for a safe, legal abortion. Now that scholarship check, Rosie's hope and future would never be cashed. Yesterday, not yesterday, Monday, the so-called highest court in the land in a purely political act determined to take away more women's lives, to make women virtual prisoners of the state. Women like Rosie, working hard to do better, be better, fulfill their dreams, will be denied their right to say legal abortions. Now is the time for courage. Now is the time for all of us to act. Congress needs to codify Roe v. Wade as the law of the land. Now is the time for all of us to put a stop to the continuing effort to control our bodies, control our lives. All of us need to act now. Let the Supreme Court know, let your reps in Congress know, let your family, neighbors, and friends know. Abortion is health care. Abortion is essential. Abortion is your right.